my next show is called The A-Gay Stillwater, Oklahoma, and it's about a boy um, hanging out with his first group of gay friends. And there's definitely some mean girls aspects um, with the show, but there's also some um, activism involved as well, because these boys are trying to increase their campus presence by engulfing all that ugly homophobia with their A-gay prettiness. I wanted to talk about affectation and how that changes um, and throughout the show you're going to be able to see a transformation. John Michael believes that because he just came out there's supposed to be a certain way he has to act being gay so he's like working on his gay voice, his uh, flamboyancy that is his mating call um, that he uses to uh, let other boys know that he's um, like them. And also it um, becomes this kind of protest. Um, to um, let other people know that uh, we are in existence in Stillwater, Oklahoma. The A-gays um, have created a subculture in Stillwater, Oklahoma where they can feel safe to be themselves. Um, and the, their safe zone has taken the form of this um, place called Gay Headquarters. And um, this is definitely an example of how I can't write this stuff, that that's an actual real detail. And um, there was an entrance policy to gay headquarters. No ugly is allowed. And these boys, they, 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 we meant so well. And we wanted to, you know, try to, you know, end hate, you know, by passing out condoms and passing out ribbons to remember those um, lost from teenage bullying. But then we would do stuff like that. Definitely Spalding Gray and Tim Miller. Um, I actually had the opportunity to work with Tim Miller and that was an awesome dream come true because I um, read a lot of his um, plays in Stillwater, Oklahoma and never thought I was able to actually be able to work with him. And um, um, Like I said, Spalding Gray, I love how he works his um, shows, how he develops them in front of an audience, and how he really just brings it down to that basic art that is storytelling. Um, I think Quentin Crisp is a huge inspiration. I just loved how he was able to um, be true to himself and still talk about, um, about style and his affectation, the way he looked, the way he, what he gave out. I would always love to come back to Dallas, but I definitely have hopes of touring my work. Um, it's very simple to move, because it's just me, and I don't really need complex lights. I don't really need to be performing in a theater, um, although that is preferable, of course. But yeah, I would love to take my shows to uh, French festivals and to colleges. Um, I think my work has something to say that is really vital to um, people my age. Hello, my name is John Michael. I am a local queer performance artist in Dallas, Texas, and I want all of you to come and see my new show at Nouveau 47 Theater called The A Gays, Stillwater, Oklahoma. It will be running March 30th to April 14th. BYOB and pay what you can.